I don't know who you are, yeah. so I, I, I need your name and address and, and phone number, so if we do have any consequences, we can send it back to so you. So I'll be had someone go around there in the past, not announce themselves that they got into a vehicle in the cleaning bay and stole it. And I'm, I'm not going to be doing that on camera. And I'm an ex-policeman. <laughs> so are you? Fucking wheel, whoever fit the wheel last, impact drivered it on so hard, it bends the tyre iron trying to take the fuck off. I'm trying to find a fucking impact driver so I can... I don't know, they must have been angry when they did that tyre. Oh, you're trying to... It's bent your thing, is it? Yeah, just trying just trying to change the tyre on the roadside. Right. And it's bent. Well, just see if they've got another one of them, just try. Well, just fucking anything, mate. Something with a little little more length and torque, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good luck, mate. <laughs> So guys, welcome back to another dealer, dealer video, we're here at Ford in Swindon, Swindon in Wiltshire. Now, it's part of the Allen Ford Group and over there is the transit centre. We've got a car here with no registration on, just perched on these uh, little ramps, look. To be honest, that ramp would be very useful at home for gearbox oil changes and things like that. I wonder if they've got a spare one they're willing to uh, part with. Let's have a look at the cars at the front. It's uh, it's quite unusual that we're here in the daytime. You right? Hello mate, you right? Can I help you? I'm just videoing. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Just for me? Just, just a video, yeah, Ford, okay. today. Fair enough. Do here in the transit centre. Okay. Yeah. Get the drone up at the top. Uh, Look at the roof. Fair yeah. Enough. Th those ramps, uh, where is it there? The car perched on. Yeah. Are they expensive, are they? I think they are quite pricey, yeah. yeah. They look good for home. <laughs> what, what are you doing with this one? Uh, it's, um, someone's bought it. Oh, right. So I'm just going to go and clean it up. Oh, you're dropping it off for them? No, I was going to put some petrol in it. Oh, I'll put some pet. Got you. Ah, very good. Cool. I'll go inside and have a look. So, yeah, Ford in Swindon. Coffee machine? For customer use only. <laughs> no staff allowed on that. Hi, right, mate. Yeah, good, you? Quiet, innit? No answer. It's a nice colour. Music as usual. Hopefully the music won't cause an issue. It's quite quiet, so we shall see. I've had a few videos lately copyrighted from uh, dealerships. Yeah. Not massive show. Look, toilets there. Office there. No registration on that one either. Got the boot open there. <coughs> Ford Cougar, 1.5 EcoBoost. Hmm. Twenty-eight grand for that one liter. Thirty-nine grand. Cougar 1.5 EcoBoost. Interesting. So look over here. What we got here? No price on this one. Nope. All right. Not much to see in here. Let's go outside. Very quiet in there. These on the doors here. Even got a barcode on. <laughs> Sold. <laughs> yeah, not much. Uh, not much customer service here, is there? Not a lot to see at all. 
pretty sure if we start filming through these windows, they're gonna start, they're gonna come and talk to us, don't they? Yeah. So we get the zoom camera out on that. Let's have a look, shall we? Most units. Dave and Laura and Steve, three. Steve and Dave, six. So week one, Cara three, Steve six. And then there, what's that? Just stats really, isn't it? About different stuff, see how they're doing. That's pretty much it. Uh, guys, closing the blinds. I've already got, I've already been in, filmed it, mate. It's done, it's finished. Uh, so yeah, Ford and Swindon. He's still trying to close the blinds over there. <laughs> no, he gave up. <laughs> he gave up. Finished anyway, buddy. Pre premises are protected by Scorpion security. Got some big ass camera up there. I think we're going to go and take a look at the van centre. Because here, doesn't seem like they even want to greet their customers. Yeah, let's go and uh, <coughs> let's go and see the van centre, shall we? Electric charging that way. But I do like these ramps. realised it's balanced on there so if that car drives back a little bit it will just drop probably how it's designed but, uh, yeah it's windy again today which is annoying which is annoying because it makes flying the drone a little bit more challenging I mean here shouldn't be too bad it's very open not many trees around but with places where you have to fly over, you know, areas where if the drone gets stuck in the sky and it won't move or anything like that, uh, you need to be able to, you know, retrieve it. So here's fine. Can't see here being an issue at all. It's not that bad. Oh, he's got one. He's found one. He's got his uh, torque wrench. So he's getting a he's getting a hand off the uh, guy from Ford here, which is good. Let's go and say hello, shall we? <clears throat> All right. Hello. I'm just doing a quick video on Ford. Oh, why? Why not? <laughs> I've just been over to the car one. Okay. Very quiet there. <laughs> they didn't even approach me. Strange. Didn't they? No. Oh really? No. Yeah. Nothing. Not, not good. No. Not good. No. So what's why do you why, want why, to, video yeah. us? Why video? to judge things like that, good or bad? Oh, I see. So there's no receptionist ever. There's literally no one there. There's one guy, and he just ignored me. Oh, okay. But here you've been obviously normal. Hi, how are you? So it's good. Yeah. Film the cars, the vans. Show you know, show guys what's going on. Yeah. Get the drone above the top. Fly above. Oh, so you work for Ford? No. Who do you work for? Well, not Ford. <laughs> we can't permit you to film, but we've got a customer in here. So yeah, I'm not going to film the customer. Um, and also, I don't give you permission. I'm not going to film in here, apart from now. Obviously, I'm going to leave and I'm going to go and have a look what you're doing over there, but just letting you know yeah, I'm that's here. That's what you're doing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Drone going above. If you see the drone, it's, it's me. So that's okay. it. All right. Yeah, thanks for that. Cheers. There we go. All done. All said. Friendly enough, at least they're better than the car. Uh, Ford over the road, the car centre. They even agreed, not good, no approaching, nothing. I might go back over there and ask them why. 
why they feel it's not appropriate to approach their customers, potential customers. Let's have a look at the vans. Coffee machine. Different locks available. There. Got a meeting going on over there. Let's have a quick look around. There's not much to see in here. A couple of uh, vehicles. Presumably many for business people buy these. Interesting. Brand new van look. Business investment that is. Again, the Ford interior look very plain and boring looking. I've always said that about Fords whenever I visit these dealers. Very basic, cheap. Look at that. Very basic. I know it's only a van, but even so. No luxury, nothing. Oh, we just had somebody else uh, poking their head around that corner there, seeing what we're doing. I think it's the same lady. But we're gonna go around here now and have a look ourselves. Oh, I think we've got the guy from the car centre coming over here. Possibly, no, maybe, maybe not, I don't know, he looks similar. Looks a very similar guy. We'll find out in a moment, won't we? <laughs> look at all these vans. I do you like the orange one there? Nice wide body kit on that. Service centre over there. Let's go and have a look, shall we? Let's see what these guys are doing. Ah, this looks like the washing area. And then over there, you've got the service centre. Who are you? I'm the manager, and you're walking around filming. I've just been told. Have you? Yeah, that's right. I went into Ford. No one approached me. Not good. Right. Not I'll good. I'll approach you. <laughs> <laughs> went to the van centre. Fine. Yeah. Just walking around doing a quick video. Oh. Just for myself. Well, for YouTube. It goes on YouTube. Why is that? Though? People like to watch how the how the dealers are doing. Well, you shouldn't, unless you you're here with her. Thing, then we would ask you to leave unless you got permission to film. Are you going to kick me off, are you? Eh? Yeah. It's not good, mate. I will. I will warn you that the video goes onto YouTube, regardless. So yeah, this will go onto YouTube. Asking you to leave. That's, That's fine. Because you're, you're, you're. That's all right. You're causing a disruption in the business. Am I? Yes. How am I doing that? Well, because everybody, you've not introduced yourself. You've yes, not I have. Told anybody. You've not said anything. You've got. I've walked straight into your reception here, and I've said I'm doing a video today. I've explained everything about it. Well, yeah, but then they, they've come to me, and they, I, I would have to get permission from head office for you to do that. But I'm not you're going quite, inside. You're, you're quite welcome to stay that side. This is a very busy area here with yeah. this and everything else, yeah. and we wouldn't want to run you over, would we? I don't know. Well, don't know. by the sounds of it. So. Yeah, let's go there. So are you kicking me off the site or are you just saying I can't be on this where I am right now because here's... is you can't be in here. This is our workshop area. This is in and out and everything Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, can I go and film the vans? Well... Because I've been inside already. I don't need to go back you in. You can, you can... There's the used vehicles there. These are customers' vehicles. Okay, yeah, yeah. Why, if you want to take the registration numbers, I don't know why you're doing it. I don't want customers' registrations on YouTube and everything else for people to use. What it is? Because we don't know who you are. Yeah. So I, 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 I need your name and address and, and phone number. So if we do have any consequences, we can send it back to so you. So I'll be honest with you. The video normally entails me going into reception, saying hello, I'm doing a video. That interaction goes onto YouTube. I walk around, I show the cars or the vans, the prices, a few of them, and I've got a drone in the bag. I go back out on the road, I get the drone above, do a big shot of everything, and I leave. That's normally what I do. Well, and this interaction, of course, but that's it. That's it. That's awesome. <laughs> sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. Yeah, well, sometimes the, the, the dealers engage. You know, it's, it's causing a disruption. Um, you haven't introduced yourself to the right people or whatever so there well i went to the car center to do that and there was no one there not one person approached me not one guy there was one guy sat down at a desk i said hello and he ignored me no, not not good mate well, not good is, this is yeah this is a service operation yeah i'm happy to move out of here because yeah by all means so yeah 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 you could have engaged and this, this could have gone in your favor do you know what i mean I, I'm, <laughs> I'm not, I'm you're not, kicking me off i'm just saying <laughs> 
it's a, we don't we don't have this every day we don't know what goes on yeah um, we do our own um, mystery shops and different things I thought you may be from Ford because Ford do it you, you could call it that the video format is kind of similar we judge the reaction to the filming it can be bad like today or it can be great and they can engage fully and go do you know what this is our site come in and have a look you know I've had that loads of places it's up to you how it goes I'm gonna let you move I'm gonna go back over there I don't want to keep you um, I'll be over there like over there if you want to come and have another chat or turn it around I'll, I'll be over there okay thank you <coughs> well there we go kicked off but I think he's uh, regretting it by the second and I do have a feeling he may well come and uh, talk again we'll see but you know he's saying I didn't uh, approach the right people well in the car centre there was no one to approach. <laughs> so what cars have we got here? Let's have a quick, a quick look. Got a Ranger, 23 plate there, 41 grand on that. Hello. Uh, I don't know, I just spoke to your manager. Yep. You don't look too happy. No, no, I've just been sent out to find you, that's all. Oh, have you? So, yeah, who's, who did you speak to? I've been in the car centre. Right. No one approached me, right. not good. Came into there. Yep. Lovely ladies, told them what I'm doing, yep. doing a video. Okay. Left there, gone okay. round there, said, just have a quick look what you're doing. Yep. That guy in the car, manager I think he is, right. approached me and said, get off. No, it's because uh, they had someone go around there in the past, and not announce themselves, that they got into a vehicle in the cleaning bay and stole it. Oh right. So they're a little hypersensitive. <laughs> and I'm, I'm not going to be doing that on camera. And I'm an ex-policeman. <laughs> so, Are you? Yeah. Did you work? Where did you work? Hampshire Police. Hampshire? Yeah. What, what level? What, um... I was PC. But, um, oh, that's nice. So uh, yeah, they're, you know, obviously site security, we need to know who's walking around and doing what. Oh, so they've sent so, the copper to come and pull me. Not really. <laughs> so, what it is, I'm doing a quick video on Ford. Right. I highlight good and bad about companies on my videos. Have you, have you had authorization from our senior management to come to this branch and do that? If I, if I do that, Yep. You guys expect it? No, we. No, do you know what? If I do that, you guys are going to make everything perfect. Well, no, we have to do everything properly because obviously we have customers' cars on site, and we have to, we're very heavily, you know, looked at for GDPR, do things properly. What can I get off the car, possibly? Well, it's in our custody, open possibly, being filmed right. with people's property in it. We right. we have to look after yeah. their interests. I'm not here to film customers' cars. I'm here to film the new cars, the prices, a few specs. Yeah. Talk to staff if they want to engage. If they yeah, don't yeah. want to engage, no worry. I've got the drone in the bag, take the drone up, do a quick shot of everything from yeah. above, uh, and I go. Yeah, that's, that's it. Fine. It's just for your own peace of mind. Feet. Uh, go on. Give us, before you start filming anything in the future, this is private property. We don't mind as long as we know what's going on and it's been authorised. The thing is, I, if, I, if I prior ask people before I come, it, it defeats the object because I like yeah, to I like to catch. Technically speaking, you know, it's a business premises with high value pieces of equipment. Anyone can walk in with a camera, right? Yeah. You can kick them off, but but they've already came in and filmed, right? Yeah. So it makes you know, sense. It's polite, isn't it? So it I went really to isn't. I went to Ford over there to let them know oh, what I'm doing. Right. Yeah. I said hi to the guy. He ignored me. Came here. I told you what I'm doing first. Then okay. I've came out and I've cracked on. Right. Fine. I haven't just walked on the sides and started filming. Okay. <laughs> because I'm the only person in the showroom today and you've met the ladies in the office. I went into there. Yeah. Been in there. Didn't see no one. Uh, oh, lady was in a meeting. I've been doing the sides and moving vehicles and yeah, yeah, busy, busy. Like that. So yeah. I'm not trying to be awkward. I'm just trying to say, you know, if we know about You've it. You've been fine, but that yeah. the older guy, the, the, mm. the manager, I think he's a manager, is he? The top guy? Yeah. Yeah. He's just, no, full, get, get off, which is... If he hasn't got management of him's approval they don't know about it. Why do they need to? Because you guys run your site if you want to promote it, promote it, you know? Yeah, but we have to go through our marketing channel and other people normally, the marketing department do that and if they think we've given permission then they're not too happy about it. It's not that could just say there's a guy turned up filming we didn't want to kick him off because it'll make the video look bad so we've let him have a quick look around well, i'm sure they wouldn't oblige us to that we again it's fine if you tell us we don't mind but in advance because again but if i do that you're going to be prepared and you're going to make everything perfect well i like to catch out people out you know well that's not what we want <laughs> <laughs> then make sure everything's good right well we do but we're <laughs> in business we have to look after customers first here's been fine over the car center there's no one in there yeah. i walked around the whole showroom not one person approached me. Right. Guy came out, looked at me, funny, and walked off. Right. It's not good, is it? If, it, if he would have been pre-warned, it would have been, oh, hi, how are you, sir? Come in. Well, you know, you know in the future, just come <laughs> and speak to the management in both buildings first and preferably phone before you do. 
if that was the way we have to operate. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah. How I operate is how I've done it. No. Sometimes it goes well, well, sometimes we have this reaction, sometimes we have a really bad reaction. Yeah. Just, it's just how it goes. And part of the video is people like to see how different businesses behave to people turning up with the camera, whether they embrace it or whether they go, oh no, go away. You know? That's part it's of it. I don't like to film the vehicles. It's just as I explained, when people we don't know or are not expecting goes around to an area where cars are open, being cleaned, or workshop doors open, yeah, yeah. health and safety, yeah, that's fair all enough. those requirements, yeah, yeah. and not that long ago a vehicle was stolen, it automatically put you get it back? into defensive mode. No, no, it disappeared permanently. And that's why... Customer's car, right? Yes. Yeah. We need to know about these things. What would happen in that situation? I presume you guys would just cover it. I it, don't know. I wasn't here then. Right. So, there we go. In your care, though, I mean. Exactly, which is why we need to know. It'd be your responsibility, wouldn't it? Yeah. To, any other business you go to in the high street, you'd have to sign a visitor's book and get a pass. Depending yes, on what you do. No, you do. I, I'm happy to sign in. No, I can. Well, I've done. I can do that in other places. We need to know you're coming. So we can pass <laughs> I'd just um, like to turn up, mate, you know? Well, then we'll have to get it catches people off guard. We'll have to get you to sign it first. Because if you're wandering around the car park, I mean, you're not reflect wearing any reflectors either. And it's dark, it's winter, you know, I say it's dark, days but are shorter yeah, 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 in yeah. an yeah. afternoon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, someone doesn't see you in a big commercial vehicle, customer or staff, you get hit. But you're not wearing fluorescent. No, yeah. but I work here. That's my responsibility to wear it. You don't. So we have to do things but properly. Isn't that my responsibility to keep myself safe? Well, if I'm not working for you, still on our premises, and if we don't know you're here, yeah. you know, but if a customer to... walks on, they're not wearing reflective gear. It's the same, isn't it? I'm a, I'm a potential no, customer. They, they walk in and say, "I've got my car here for X, Y, and Z," whereas you're right. saying you're not going to do that. Do you see it that I could be a potential customer? That's fine. Right. You would walk in a showroom and tell me you're here, then. <laughs> I have. <laughs> yeah. You well, weren't in I there. I didn't see you. You see. No. So there it's we not go. my problem, though. Not not my not my fault. Well, you know? Anyway, look after yourself. I'm doing a drone. I'm, I'm finished here. I'm okay. going to get the drone above and okay. then I'll be gone. You have a good Christmas. Thank you, mate. Okay. You too. Take care. <coughs> there we go. Ford. Ex-policeman. Hampshire Police. Interesting. Very, very interesting. We are going to get the drone up here uh, very quickly, though. Not going to spend long at all. Just to have a quick, quick look around. Why not? Oh, we've got some smashed up cars on there. Not good either, is it? No. All right, guys, let's get above Ford then, shall we? There's the transit center. Quite a large place for just vans, isn't it? Yeah. There's the car park where we're standing. And over there is the car dealer. Let's go and have a little look at the car dealer, shall we? Where they weren't the most welcoming, were they? No. Quite a clean roof, though. Disabled parking there, look. Bays are rubbed out, though. Got an electric charging one there. Customer parking. Got a little roof there, a little uh, shelter for bikes nice there's the rest of Swindon <laughs> let's go and have a little look at the service centre shall we let's get right over There we go. So this is where the car was stolen from, apparently. Oh, hello, buddy. Yep, 
got some work going on there. They've closed the doors there for um, likely due to the cold. Weird, isn't it, how Ford have had a bad reaction in a few places now? I don't know if it's the way they're trained or the way that just their staff are employed. I don't know. Lack of training, maybe. Who knows? But yeah, it's cleaning that one up, look. Very, very interesting. This guy may be coming to talk to us. Is he going to come and talk? What do we think? Maybe, maybe not. Find out in a minute. Sorry, Hello. If you want to film, if you want to film here, there, yes. that's fine. But please don't film us. I'm not feeling comfortable working, being watching. It's in the sky, mate. Huh? It's in the sky. Yeah, but it's filming. It's high up, man. I know, yeah. But can't see who you are. Huh? You can't see you. You can now, because you're close to me, but the drone's in the sky. It's not filming you, mate. Yeah. Don't worry. It's just <laughs> being like being, being watched, yeah? No, no, no. I was watching the cars. Don't worry. I'm, I'm, I'm finished over there anyway, okay. Yeah, I thought he might be coming over. But we're not here to film him. We'd have a quick look at what he was doing and that's it. Got some uh, bonnets up there. Something's being done to that. Wonder what. Look at that parking there. <laughs> Not good, is it? Look at that. Oh, we've got some uh, more people. So there are actually staff here. We, we didn't see any before. Looks like a customer being shown a car there. And that... Where is he? Looks like the manager. There he is, Mr. Manager. It's quite windy. See the drone moving about, look. He's telling the manager he is. He's telling the manager. Yeah. Why are you causing a scene, mate? Why are you causing a scene? You know, I'm finished, all right. I'm finished. All right, so take care. Cheers, man. There we go. All done. And it is cold today. Didn't think it was that cold, but it's actually quite cold. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Ford in Swindon. What are we thinking, everyone? Not the best, was it? Not the best at all. Uh, yeah, if you like the video guys, give it a thumbs up and don't forget, give the channel a subscribe.